because I well, find you over well, well, yeah. You know me, I'm an, I, I can be something of a cynic occasionally. We've seen this in the past where yeah. we know that someone has been plucked from whatever stardom they have to have yeah. and they're told by a management company put on a whole load of weight get really big have a picture taken outside if you're looking shocking yeah uh, and then once you've done that uh, then we'll we'll put you on a massive diet you look amazing and we'll sell your DVDs in your book so that hasn't happened to you sadly that wasn't the case I got fat on my own accord <laughs> <laughs> Sadly, <laughs> which is really annoying. You didn't, you didn't really care that much before, did I you? I didn't so care at all. So what changed in your head? Because, I mean, it's an inspiration to lots of people where you sort of go, I, I'm just not a natural gym goer. I'm just not that person. Do you know what it was? It was me mum. It was when it was coming from the people closest to you, me mum was starting to get really worried. And there was times when we were literally arguing that much about food. She would hide the takeaway menu. She would, would be in massive rows. I remember I was on an appearance in Ireland and she'd stayed in the hotel and I'd went at the club appearance and I'd came back and I'd got like three meals from McDonald's and I'd hid in the bathroom to eat them but you could hear the rustling of all the cheeseburger papers right. and she was like Charlotte what are you doing I went oh no I'm just, I've just got some chicken nuggets she was like there's more than that there and she came in and she was so angry we had this massive row and I cried for weeks we went to the airport we weren't even speaking we didn't even sit next to each other on the plane and it got to the point where it was really coming in between me and my family because she could see that I was unhealthy and mm. she didn't want that and for not, our daughter yeah Necessarily happy. We're looking. I mean, you look through this. There seems to be. I mean, I've just seen a, a, a recipe for poached eggs there. So it's all quite <laughs> sensible so, yeah, things. Yeah, there's some isn't sensible it? and there's, there's some really normal things. What everyone kind of knows what to do. But then there's some really exotic. Exotic things like the the lovely sweet potato brownies. Well, okay, so a you sweet need to try. potato brownie. You right? It so sounds. How is that good? Wait, I need to tell you before before you get to try it. Right, this has got. Not really any chocolate in it. It's only got cocoa powder, cinnamon powder, sweet potatoes, eggs. But taste it. It's so nice. Oh, God, I hope you like it. Yeah, I know. You've built <laughs> this is too much pressure. It's not... Isn't it nice? I like it. All right. Isn't it? Mm. It doesn't taste very chocolatey. It's not very chocolatey, but you've still got that kind of chocolate It's, giving, um, it's giving you it's that... It's a little bit coconutty. It's, it's giving me a yeah, cake cake mix. Mix. Mm. But, I, but you'd never know the sweet potato. No, no, never. That's the thing. No. Like, that's what I thought. And we're literally on the shoot day when we took nice. all the pictures, I ate a full tray. <laughs> Which is, is that, what you're supposed to, to really no, I mean, be doing. You're not supposed to do that, but that's how good it is. What about exercise? Because you can't lose weight by eating sensibly if you don't put a bit of exercise Yeah, in you've there. got to. And I think that's that's why, obviously, I do the exercise DVDs, because I think exercise is so important. And not eat good throughout the week. How often a week? Four you, times. Four times a week. Mm -hmm. Wow, OK. Because you, I mean, you've changed entirely. It's not just your body mm -hmm. and your healthy eating now as well, but you, you've got a new nose. Yes, I've got a new nose. And how are you getting on with that? The new nose and me are really good friends. <laughs> Why did you do your nose? Because I had oh, it. No, you had a lovely nose. No, no, no. I mean, we can't really tell that. I really that. enjoyed it. But, but what's wrong with that it nose? It was a bump, and I, I wasn't happy with it, right? Yeah. So I was like, I'm going to change it. If I'm not happy with it, why am I sitting around being unhappy when I can change it? So yeah. I just changed it. Have you got any plans to do anything else? Nothing. I do, my worry is, no, I is don't that like this boobs. begins to grow and becomes no, a thing. I mean, great, I think good luck to you. If you want to have plans to say you better, brilliant. Go. I don't have any plans for anything else. I don't like boobs. I'd rather have none. Um, I don't have... Well, there's what else is it to get? I've lost weight. There's no, no plans for anything. Well, you've so got so you, you've, uh, 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 face happy, body, body happy, happy, healthy happy. Healthy what happy. about heart happy? Is your heart happy? I feel like it's... Well, I'm very happy today. I feel like the heart is like 100% happy today. So I was a bit because I, I missed you when you came on Juice, and I know you got quite upset on the show, and yes, I was a bit like, gosh, I kind of, I was just hoping well, you were right because I wasn't, I didn't know how yes, you were. Yes, it was a bit of a sad time, but it was fine because me and Gino had a little bit of a down and contest with Guinness afterwards. Good. So that made us feel a bit better. But um, no, my heart is happy at the minute. Because this is surrounding sort of gas, isn't it? And it is on, on, off, yes. on, off, and it's a little bit tricky. And it's a, li it's a little bit off at the minute. And well, he's about to go to Thailand to do X on the he beach. He is literally doing X on the beach now, so he's going on dates with people and stuff. And I don't know. Mm. I don't want to get upset again. No, 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 okay. no, no. We wouldn't do that. We wouldn't do that. In, in we... which case, so you would you would shift shift your shift your approach and and and, and look somewhere else. Yes, I think you need to find someone whose job it isn't to be single. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I feel yeah, like Gaz's yeah, yeah, job course, is to be single well. on TV. I feel with like women. I also need to move away from Geordie Shaw. Mm. 
but not the, not the, I mean that's the, the maybe the relationships within but not the show itself because because there's a there is a Geordie Shaw the best of the best oh the reunion the reunion show, yes the, the reunion which we've already filmed which is out on the 10th of May on MTV obviously and it is gonna be the best Who series ever uh, well I can't spoil it Holly oh well, well is it all the old oh game? my god yes I can they're all there <laughs> <laughs> I can't spoil it. So there's Sophie. Oh. So I'm so happy, Sophie. Sophie's my best friend. I've missed that so much. Um, and then there's Jay. Look at the front. We call him the Silverback Gorilla because he's oh, the yes. guy of the group. James, there's James. And look, they've all Ricky. been and had their eyebrows done at the oh, salon, which is all, great all news. Had tints and stuff. So awesome. when you say you would move away from Geordie Shore, that would maybe help your heart. Does do you mean the show? I think it, in time, I think it, I'm going to have to. Because you, I, I read something this morning. It said that you, you know, you want to see it right the way through till the very end. But have you changed your mind? I kind of have. Have you? Mm -hmm. Is it time to move on? I don't. I haven't made my mind up yet, but it, I'm feeling that way. Mm. And what would you do? What, what if you if you come oh, out? I just of don't know. You said you'd like to see a panel show. Yes. Could you take on the likes of Keith Lemon? Of course. Yeah, you could actually. I could. I bet if anybody. <laughs> You definitely could. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't think you've got much to worry about because the Three Minute Belly Blitz DVD was the fastest selling fitness DVD in 15 years, sold twice as many as Frozen. What? And the, and the yeah, and the, that, that in that particular time. Yeah. And, and your book's doing pretty well as well. So the you're all right. Doing well, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here it is Charlotte Crosby, Live Fast and Lose Weight 80 Recipes for a Healthy Lifestyle. Fat to, to fit. Thank you so much. <laughs> right. I've had a lovely time. You look amazing. <laughs> and Thank you, darling. Yeah. Thank you. Take care of yourself.